Hey everyone, so I got another package, um, nothing dolly related, I'm pretty sure it's another book of mine? I think it's another book. It was supposed to be here two days, yesterday, yesterday. It was supposed to be here yesterday or two days ago or something like that, but it didn't come in, so. I'm just gonna open it, I think I can just rip it, just like the other one. I think I, I, I ordered it from the same place, I'm pretty sure, that I ordered my other manga that I got, which I have read this guy, it is so cute, um, it's not like a hardcore yaoi, like, uh, sex and rape in it every five seconds, it's, it's not like a normal one shot either, it's a cute one shot, uh, it's, it has a couple different stories, I think about five, and the last one is called Almost Crying, and that one's really cute too, um, I can't remember which was my favorite, but there's a couple, and they're really cute, um, there's no hint of sex or violence in it, uh, just really cute, I, I, I really suggest this if you're looking for a really cute yaoi and you don't like the hardcore stuff, I don't really like the hardcore stuff that much either, but, um, but I have to say, Boys that love each other is so cute. Yep, this is it. Um, so this is by June, and um, what I was saying about the June uh, publishing. Uh, see, that's the June publishing, and then here is the other publishing, which is the DMP, which stands for Digital Manga Publishing. Um, so yeah, they look pretty similar. That's what I was, like, confused about. But this is called, um, You and Harogion? You and Harogion? I don't know. It looks pretty cute, actually. It looks really cute. He's, like, putting flowers in his hair or something. Um. So, yeah, it's a native manga. Um, I really like... I've never read a m Americanized manga, which is left to right, like a normal book. Um, but it is right to left, so it is like a normal manga. Um, it's YA, which is for young adults, 16 and up. Um, so I'm, I'm guessing it has a hint of something in it, maybe. It's not 18 plus, so it's definitely not going to be hardcore yaoi. Um, I'm not even sure. This is a YA too, so it's 18 and up. I mean, I'm 16 and up. Um, I got this one for like three bucks, and this one is like two, three bucks as well. Um, just a little cheaper. So yeah, I'm really excited to read it. So um, let me just read the back for you guys if you guys are interested in buying one. I just uh, look up yaoi on eBay and go to uh, uh, lowest shipping and price thing, and it will show up. The first one, pretty much. Um, Horace stands alone, like the lonely flower he once named that he was once named after. He alone stands atop a field of green, with his face upturned to the sun, as a harsh wind of reality rocks him into fro. After the untimely death of his father, the teenage Haru finds himself orphaned and facing a mountain of debts left behind by his parents. By his parents, confused and naive, Haru isn't quite sure what to do until a friend from the past, Mr. Shion, 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 something, comes to his rescue. Shino, him, it turns out, is a lawyer and is willing to be able to help Haru. Help that soon expands beyond Haru's legal needs. As his feelings snowball, his feelings snowball, Sino must now figure out what he wants to be, what, what he wants to be for Haru. Um, surrogate father or lover? This seems pretty cool. Um, 
I don't know if I'm gonna like it. Uh, there wasn't really a description. I just seen it, and I wanted to get it since it was cheap and it's really good. Um, it looks well drawn. I like the way it's drawn. I mean, it's not like some of the bad manga which are really badly drawn. This has a whole bunch of different things. It's, it's okay. But I think it's going to be pretty cool to read. And if I get any more packages in tomorrow, which is a Saturday, which I might, I will, got, I will show it to let you guys know how this is because I'm going to read this. Um... But yeah, I'm excited to read it. I'm also going to be ordering another manga that is a cheaper manga from the same place. Um, uh, I forget what it's called, but I know the art is, it said art is not final, but it has a final art book somewhere, final manga somewhere published and everything. And it, it was like, like 12 bucks for the final, but it's like 3 bucks for the non-final. I'm going to go ahead and get it, actually. This is by Keito, Keito Kinoshita, Keito Kinoshito, Kinoshita, and Endless Crying, which I really, really recommend because it's so cute, and Kawaii is by Mako Takahashi, Mako Takahashi, and Kino, Keito Kinoshita, um, they're looking for uh, some manga. I mean, I I even I read manga online um, most of the time, so I do like to have some manga books because sometimes something happens. Sometimes my internet's not working, um, especially during a storm. The internet doesn't really work that well, so I like to have some manga close by. I have a whole bunch upstairs. Um, not a whole bunch. I probably have like ten books upstairs in manga. Three yaoi's upstairs and not hardcore, but you know. Excited to add these to my collection. Definitely make my friend read them because make her read all my manga that I get. But, so I'm gonna go ahead and read all this stuff. I'll read this one, and like I said, I'll let you guys know how I feel about it. Um, if it's good and if it's worth buying, it's only three bucks, so I thought it was worth buying just to read it. 